everyone is fine and safe at your home. I am also fine. Today I am here to conduct a lesson on class 4 English for today. In 33 lesson 3, 4, 5. Before going to start the lesson, I am introducing myself. I am Pallavi Mahundar, assistant teacher, also a model of primary school, also a barber. Students, are you ready to join with me? Please take your textbook, pen, exercise book and be attentive to the lesson. Okay dear students. Students, look at the board. Here are some words. Can you read the words? I hope you can. Let's read. The first one is cook. Cook. Yes. The second one is read. Read. Thank you so much. The third one is walk. Walk. Walk up for hatta. The fourth one is play. Play. Play means flower. Next, make. Make. Make means toy kara. Go. Go. Go means zawa. See. See. See means dekha. Walk. Walk. Walk means kaas kara. Eat. Eat. It means khawa. Sit. Yes. Sit. Sit means bosha. Thank you so much. Students, can you tell what kind of parts of speech are these words? Yes. These are bhar. These are bhar. Because each of the word indicates doing something. Okay dear students. Students, before we have learned about the three forms of verb. Present, past, past participle. Isn't it? Yes. Now, I like to ask you the past form of these words. Okay, dear students? What is the past form of cook? Can you tell? Yes, cook. The past form of cook is cook. Read? No, it will be read. The past form of read is read. There is no difference between the expelling of the present form and past form of read. But there is a difference between pronunciation. Ok dear students? Uh, what? What? Yes. Play? Play. Make? Make. Go? Yes. Wait. See? Saw. What? What? Eat? Yes. Add. See? Said. Okay dear students. Thank you. Can you tell 
What are people doing here? Yes, play football, climb kite, summer sitting on the grass, talking. Yes, students, I like to know you the simple present form of the verb. What is the simple present form of play? Can you tell? Yes. Play. Thank you. Fly. Fly. Yes. Talking. Correct. Talk. Talking. Talk. Sitting. Yes. Sit. Thank you. Students. Now, we, you have to complete this paragraph that is related to this picture. You have to remember that the picture is of yesterday. So, the activities the people here are doing are also of yesterday. As the picture is of yesterday, so you have to complete this paragraph using the simple past tense form of the verbs that are given in the brackets. Please look for the verbs in the brackets. Students, I also uh, want to with my 
big brother and sister. We jumped and ran through the trees. Then we went home in the car. The traffic was heavy. So we were in the car for a long time. But it was a good day. Okay dear students. I hope your answers and my sentences have matched equal. Dear students, now we are going to work on activity B that is related to activity A. Okay dear students, look through the questions of activity B. Try to read with me question number one. Where did Shamin go? Question number two. Who did he go with? Question number three. What did he eat? Question number four. Where did he sleep? Question number five. What did he do with his brother and sister? Question number six. How was the traffic on the way home? Dear students, um, I am reading again. Where did Shami go? Can you say yes? Shami go. Sorry, Shami went to the park. Shami went to the park. Can you tell where do you have the answer? Yes, in the first blank. In the first. Blank. Thank you. Question number two. Who did he go with? Can you tell who did he go with? Yes. He went with his family. He went with his family. Question number three. What did he eat? What did he eat? He ate sandwiches and fruit. Thank you. Question number four. Where did he sit? Can you say? Yes. He sat on the grass. He sat on the grass. Question number five. What did he do with his brother and sister? Yes. He jumped and ran, ran through the trees with his brother and sister. Question number six. How was the traffic on the way home? The traffic was heavy on the way home. Thank you everybody. Students, um, you can also uh, practice questioning and answering at your home with your, your father or mother, sister, brother. Okay dear students, now we are going to work on activity C. Students, think what did you do yesterday? Okay? Try to remember what did you do yesterday? For example, um, yesterday I went. Can you say anything about your yesterday activities? For example, uh, I yesterday I went to market with my mother or yesterday I drew a picture. Okay dear students, now 
look on your textbook on activity c look here are two sentences yesterday i walk to school then yesterday i ate rice and vegetables students um, now i like to um, ask everyone to write a sentence about your yesterday activities i am giving you one minute time okay have you finished okay everybody is okay students now take the homework please Thank you everybody.